Hello people, I'm coming to you live with an unboxing from uh, Pink Zebra. It's a small haul, not a very big haul. Um, I only got three things, but I think you'll like what I got. And I'm going to read the description from the webpage too. So I've got the webpage up, so I'm ready to go. And the first thing I'm going to show you, and I'm so excited, but before I show it to you, I'm going to tell you, I opened up the box, I looked in the box, but I have not smelled anything. So I don't know what any of this smells like, except for the one thing I do, because I've had it before. Now, here's the first thing I've got. It is coconut frappe. It's a 16 ounce carton sprinkles. Now what's nice about the sprinkles is you can take a little bit of these sprinkles and a little bit of, say, these sprinkles and mix them, okay? That's what's nice about this. It's easy to mix and it's easy to put how much you want for your scent. Now they recommend two scoops, but sometimes I use one scoop, sometimes I use a scoop and a half, but I use no more than two scoops. So, you ready to see what it is? It's called Coconut Frappe. It is frozen mocha coffee with toasted coconut piled with sweet whipped cream. Sounds good, doesn't it? Our coconut frappe fragrance is a thoughtful blend of professionally created ingredients enhanced by the addition of vanilla oil. Don't forget to add a simmering light or simmering pot. So, all you do is take, a, take the uh, scooper that's in here, fill up the scooper, pour it in your thing, and if you don't want it real strong, start out small, and if you can't smell it, add a little more. And mine usually lasts two or three days. It's when I have to change it. But I don't need mine on all night either. So, we're gonna see what it smells like. And it's brown. Oh, if you love coffee and frappes, you're gonna love this. Oh, this smells so good. <coughs> now, we're gonna put the lid back on and I'm gonna read you the back. This smells really good. Yes. If you really love this, I would get two. These will last you forever, but I would get two in case they sell out. It says, sprinkles are pink zebra signature scent, eco-friendly, soft soy wax melt. Enjoy the aroma just as, just as is our personalized your sprinkles by blending one or more together to create a strong, long lasting fragrance. This one you do not need to mix with anything unless you want to make it a different coffee flavor. How to use sprinkles. Pour two scoops, it says three, but I use two, of sprinkles in the, in, onto a dish of simmering light or simmering pot. Turn on and enjoy. Sprinkles are designed to last for up to three eight hour days. And yes, that is true. How to change your sprinkle. Well, I'm not going to read that because I'm just going to explain it to you. Wait for your sprinkles to get wait for it to get hard in the in the little pot of your uh, serene light once it's all hard take it to your freezer put it in your freezer leave it in for about 10 to 15 minutes and take it out of the freezer and then just pop it right out put it back on your simmering light biggest thing you need to do is to let it warm up because it's been in the fridge or you'll crack your dish to room temperature and then there you go. Or I usually take a cotton ball while it's still, you know, liquidy and soak up the liquid. And then I put it into an old cotton ball bag that's empty and I save them. That way I have good fire starters. They are wonderful. They, they make, when you go outside and have a fire, they start right up. I love doing that. And plus the best thing is they smell good. So. Now, let's get into the second thing that I've gotten. Okay, these are soaks. These are what you use in your wall hook or use in your um, This is what you use on your, uh, I'll show you here in a second, because when I bring the pages up, I'll show you a few things that you can put on your soaks, your soaks for. First, I gotta find what it is.
Okay. It is lavender Okay, we found it. It is lavender air care is what it is. I'm gonna take it out and show you what it looks like. So now, okay, there's two things you can do with this. Now, this is the soak, okay? This is what you gotta do with it. You take this top off, okay? There's a thing inside that you got to take off, see? This ring stays on though. You need the ring. Okay, now, you can peel this off and then you got your soap. So then what you do is, you take this part off, okay, if I can get it. See, and then you just do this. Or, and it's good for the stuff that you can put in your car. I'll show you in a minute. Or you can change them out, put this in, see, and then pop this lid off, and then you do this in the air, or on yourself, or the pets when they come in when they're wet, or furniture, or in the air. It's great for anything and everything. So, that is your lavender air care. So, now, I'm going to read you the description of what it is. And what it does is it takes all the bad smells out of your house and puts in new smells. And it comes in carton, soak, and jar sprinkles. So here's the description. It is our lavender air care fragrance with a thoughtful blend of professionally created ingredients enhanced by the addition of natural eucalyptus and la lavendine oils. Okay. It says, lemongrass eucalyptus has been shown to effectively eliminate smell, pet, and garlic malodors. Eliminates a variety of common malodors, including smoke. And what it does is, it says, it freshens the air and neutralizes odors with notes of crisp and smooth lavender. I love this smell. I love this thing. I would highly recommend it. I've already gone through one soak of it. Did you see? I even got my daughter on it. She loves it too for her bathroom. Now, the next one we got is shortbread. Okay, same concept. It's another soak. T switch the lids. You can spray. And what's nice with the wall hug, you can take a little bit of this and a little bit of this blend them together and you've got a new scent. There's millions of ways to do these things and they are wonderful. So here's what it says for the soak. It's it's a 3.75 ounce full, full thing of soak. So it would do at least do your wall hug, at least it did mine three times before I, ha before I ran out. So it says it's buttery and sweet, a crumbly sugar infused perfection. Our shortbread cookie fragrance is a thoughtful blend of professionally created ingredients enhanced by the addition of lemon oil. And it says, don't forget to add, ju add a just add soap or wall hug, which I'm going to show you here in a second in the pictures. So we're going to go to, I don't know what Okay, I'm going to show you what a wall hug is. Okay. Down here at the bottom, as you can see, see it? That's your wall hug, and you can buy that wall hug by itself, or you can buy it with a jar of, or a, a soak, which is a better way to go. That's how I do it all the time. And then this and this one are decorations you can put on this, okay? Now that's one way of doing your soaps. Now I'm gonna show you another way. Let's see if I can find it. Okay, now this is something else you can buy in your car, for your car. You hang it in your car 
Yeah, let it, so it comes in like this, and you get, they each get their own little bag. And what you do is, you put the bag, you put the soaps inside the bag, and then you let it sit in the bag for a few days, and then you go hang it in your car. And then once the flavor's gone, do it again. It'll last up to like 50 uses per bag. So, yeah, your car will always smell good. So, what I do is, I always do one bag, and always have a bag handy, so that way, when I run, when the first, when the first one stops smelling, I will throw it, or I will take the second one out of the bag and just put it right into my vehicle. That way, I've got two bags going, and it could be two different scents, so you'll always have a different scent in your car. Now, here's something else we can put. You can put it on. And these are other things that you can hang in your car or hang in your closet or anywhere. They're called hang -its. They're They're really nice. I love them. I have a french fry one. What you do is they're felt. So you spray the felt and the felt will keep the uh, scent for a while. And when you can't smell it anymore, no you just go out there and spray your felt again. That's really nice. I love doing that. And then here's the last one. Okay. These are for like, if you want to put them in a bathroom that has no outlets or all the outlets are being used, you just set it on top of your toilet or if you got a shelf, not these two, but there may be more because these are not here yet, it says coming. So that's what those are. You just spray the felt, the felt part of it and put it in your, uh, wherever there's no place to plug something in and let it go and it's really nice now here's the last thing i'm going to show you these i think are wonderful you fill this jar up you stick these sticks inside and when you can't smell it anymore you just flip the stick but i'm going to show you this okay i'm going to show you this one that i really love see this right here this one that one keep it like it is and see this thing that looks like a soak you just do uh, tighten it inside so that no soaks can come out and you just do flippy flippy and then you're, so you're ready again you don't even have to touch the reeds but they've got this kind this kind see and then we got that kind we got that kind and that kind and this one's new because it's got flowers so that is what you do with your soak so let's see I'm trying to see. We now have, while I'm on the on on talking to you, we now I'm going to show you the newest thing we've got, the new uh, thing that we've got. It's called Super Clean. It we have hand sanitizer. We have let's see inside it. We have hand sanitizer. We have. Um, hand sanitizer, we have hand soap, and then something else, and I can't remember what it is, but yeah, so that's my haul, that's what I wanted to show you, if you like my video, give me a thumbs up, if you don't like the video, give me a thumbs down, it's not going to hurt my feelings, it's just to tell me that I'm, I need to do better, and if you like my video real well, hit the subscribe button, and then you'll know, uh, when I do another video. Bye.